And now it's time to meet our hackathon winners. Around 180 registered participants from across the uh, industry and around the world have been battling it out in this year's competition. They certainly have, and the challenge has been to come up with novel solutions that use artificial intelligence and machine learning to enhance the accuracy of anomaly detection in payments and to build these synthetic transaction data sets required for AI-based product development whilst protecting privacy. That's a hell of a brief. It's a tall order. <laughs> and I'm delighted to say that we're joined by a representative from each of the winning teams, Shashank Gupta, Lead Business Functional Analyst from Deutsche Bank, and Monique Bahera, Software Engineer at Onyx by JP Morgan. Congratulations to you both. And we're also joined by Swift Hackathon Manager, Veronique Constant. Welcome to you all to Cybos TV. Hi, great to be here. Fantastic, it's excellent to see you. Veronique, let me start first with you, because look, you managed a hackathon in 2021, so can you tell us a little bit more about this year's record-breaking competition? Because I guess you had your hands full. <laughs> yes, yes, you can definitely say that. So I'm really, really happy with this year's edition. Um, it was the third year in a row that we, we run a hackathon. So on the one hand, you know, we had built experience to do that. On the other hand, we thought, you know, how do we raise the bar further and make it even better? So uh, we decided to um, create, to set up a, a platform, a dedicated hackathon platform that we could use to communicate with the participants, but also with the sandbox where they could actually uh, build and develop and test their solution. And we used a FinTech Sandpit from Naya One for this, and they were a fantastic partner. So they really contributed to the success of the hackathon. And at the same time, our AI platform provider, uh, C3.ai, also allowed us to use their Ex Machina tool, which allows for machine learning models uh, development and testing. And that was also, you know, another other tool that we wanted to provide the participants. So overall, it was a busy four months, you know, between the partner setup, the internal setup for the for the data sets, the uh, engagement with the participants. But you know, when I look back, well worth the effort um, because the the engagement, the response from the members, um, the high quality level of the solutions, it all makes it worth it. And also it shows that, you know, a hackathon is a really good way for us to engage and innovate together with the, with the community. So very positive. Shashank, it was quite the brief. It was difficult enough for us to say, let alone for you to undertake, I would imagine. Uh, tell us a bit about the journey that it's been on, uh, that you've been on over the past, over the past few weeks. Yeah, so it's been, it's been a fantastic experience uh, and, a, and a big thanks to the organizer for that. The hackathon was a wonderful opportunity to network and collaborate with industry leaders and work on innovative solutions. We are a team of nine enthusiasts from Deutsche Bank having diverse set of skills with expertise not only in machine learning and AI, but also in transaction monitoring and anti-financial crime. That helped us in tackle the problem holistically. We, we are a multinational team with people based in Germany, Singapore, and Romania within corporate bank technology. Our step to success have been to start with market research and then try out various options. We split into smaller working groups to try out different approaches iteratively, use the standard methods to ensure cross-validation and reviews. We, had, we conducted daily stand-ups which was the, you know, a, a melting pot of ideas and was the most exciting and enjoyable part of the journey. We also built an internal leaderboard, which helped us to keep on track with the progress and find out the best solution. We then put our solution to evaluate against test data. The public leaderboard came in very handy here. It was very helpful. It ignited the healthy competition across team, and it also helped us tremendously by motivating us to push further towards higher accuracy, to fine tune the model, to come up with a more reliable and winning solution. Okay, so an approach that was very forensic, but also holistic as well, and it achieved terrific results. What about you, Monique? Tell us a bit about your experience. What did you do? Uh, first of all, thank you all for having us here. And as Sashank mentioned, it, it has been a really exciting, I would, I would not say for a few weeks, I think a few months now, so we also had around 10 member group uh, who are actually diversified across the globe uh, in US, India, then London, everywhere. 
so our approach was little different because in our case so we are actually from link onyx group in jp morgan where we have had a good experience in decentralized financial products and we have had experience with analytics where we are required to maintain the right set of privacy so technically we have a, a group of uh, folks who have you know checked up on us to see like whether we are using data in like data privacy and all we are, whether we are maintaining them or not with that experience and in our experience with federated learning we came up with multiple solutions and ideas where we can generate synthetic data for a uh, financial use case swift is one of the format which we were we had people with experience in and we had folks who had ideas around how we can generate uh, like what are the fields and all so that really helped uh, us after that uh, we tried out multiple deep learning models uh, gan was one of them which we used finally we were settled upon and with that the most important part for our solution was to impl- the collaborate between multiple banks or financial institutes right because using federated learning we were getting that opportunity to not share the data but sorry uh, uh, basically without sharing the data we can still create a global machine learning model which can benefit each and every participant whether a participant is able to uh, provide that huge source of data or resources or not is a separate thing but federated learning helps us to democratize the machine learning problem for each and every bank who are present on networks like swift or link by jp morgan or any other such wow. so that's really exciting and we didn't have any uh, leader board but we were uh, like you know basically validating against our own uh, problem statistics our own algorithms sure. so yeah that really helped a lot with us Absolutely but look it's a fantastic achievement on the on behalf of everybody really you've done a wonderful wonderful job and I'm sure it's really going to revolutionize the particular areas in which you specialize but thank you so much for joining us on Cybos TV congratulations once again on a phenomenal achievement thank you all